I'm Scott Nagatoshi from the Miller delegation. All of the advisors are supposed to be in contact with the, uh, all of the heads of the different program areas to ensure that they know what attendance looks like so in case of an evacuation or a lockdown they're able to follow the procedures put in place by each of the different facilities that we stay at and then they're able to contact with different advisors so that they can get that kind of information out to the parents, let the parents know what's going on with all their delegates and where they are. Maya Herrera from the Culver Palms Family YMCA. Katie Carrera from the Culver Palms Family YMCA. Jeffrey Wilkins from the Culver Palms Family YMCA. Cheney Zito from the Culver Palms Family YMCA. Um, yes, um, for fire alarms, we have to safely exit the building. And for earthquakes, you get underneath the table. And you don't talk to anyone unless they have a badge. Uh, Jaden Hall, DFY. Um, I believe it would be like tuck and roll if there's a fire. Um, and wait for directions from any advisors, look for authorities. Uh, if there's like, if you're like immediately near it, I think the first thing you should probably do is get out of the building mm -hmm. and then wait for further instruction. Jolie Manor, Miller Family Y. Uh, Shay, SVC Central. Tejas, SVC Palo Alto. Evelyn, SRV Valle Lobo. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> safety? Yeah. I don't know the safety procedures, no. Wait, for like evacuating or something? Yeah. Just like run, fire you know. or earthquake. Oh yeah, like stop, drop, and cover. Like, yeah, sure. <laughs> well, like, it's kind of ingrained in society, so I think we would know them. Like, um, people would be like, hey, like guys, like you got to evacuate the building, and that we would follow that. Carter Rogan, Eldo, Capital Coalition. Uh, no, not really. Hi, I'm Natalie Scriabin, SRV Valle Lobo. For fire? Yeah. No. Eva Huerta, Wangar East Los Angeles. Melissa Cerda, Wangar East Los Angeles. Jacqueline Cabrera, Wangar East Los Angeles. Mia Zambrano, Wangar East Los Angeles. No. No. <laughs> no. Not like the like actual one. Yeah, not from like here. Yeah, I don't know it. I don't know it. Hi, I'm Nalaysia from the Gold Country Delegation, and we're today asking people what they would do in case of an emergency. What would you do in case of an earthquake? An earthquake, yeah. <laughs> I'm Aubrey Kim from East Valley YMCA. There's a table here, I'd go. Um, I'd go into a doorway or any like solid structure, maybe a closet. Um, thinking of like the hotel uh, under a desk, a chair, anything to and you know duck and cover. Okay, so in case of an earthquake, what would you do? Uh, I would probably hide under a desk or a different kind of uh, you know some kind of table or platform or a chair can you know cover my head, cover my cover my neck, you know, uh, do the little school drill uh, and then follow whatever else they tell me when the ground starts shaking. We'll evacuate the building and. Yeah. What do you do in case of a fire? 